and thar she blows. Even from a distance, we can tell what kind of whales these are by the way they bend and arch their spines as they dive, creating the humped back that gives them their common name. The guy has entanglement wounds. It's time to get to work. We're going to scope each whale to see if any are entangled, and we're going to identify as many individuals as possible. To do that, we need a camera. Take pictures of the left and the right side of the dorsal fin, as well as the fluke. Humpbacks are one of the easiest of the great whales to identify. Each one has a unique fingerprint. It's just not on its finger. It's on the underside of the whale's flukes, also known as its tail, which can be up to 18 feet wide. Lucky for us, humpbacks almost always show their flukes when they do a deep dive. Almost always. Psych! Yeah, mm. That's better.